Okay, guys. Good. Wait, wait. Focus, focus, focus on me. Focus, focus. Ah! Focus on me. Fuck, fuck. Focus on me. Anyway, I break the new mic. <laughs> Hi guys, this is Ri. I'm back. Mama Kinis na. Paano niyo makikita yung kilikil? Hi! Ulitin natin! Hi, this is Romney. This is Ri. Ah. Okay, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Hi guys, this is Ri. I'm back. Mama Kinis na. Kilikil! Ay! 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 And this week, we back it out again. Hindi ko lang sakon ako eh. So this week, naisip ko na since this is gonna be the last week for Pride Month. Yay! Naisip ko na gumawa na lang ako na parang super duper Pride Month inspired video. Hello, kung di nyo po pansin. Meron ako ng flag dito, meron ako ng rainbow flag sa aking chest. And if di nyo pa po alam, yes, I am gay, I'm openly gay. But, I just wanna let you guys know first and foremost, please do not ask gender questions in public. That's not okay, especially kung yung tao hindi naman pa sinasabi out loud na kung ano siya. But anyway, I just want you guys to remember that this month, in any month, sana kahit anong month man, we should make other people feel inclusive and they're included. Kahit ano man sila, let's not force other people to come out. Let's just wait for them, support them, hug them, whoever they are, whatever they are, straight, gay, bi, trans, ally, let's just be supportive of one another. And in honor again of Pride Month, ito po ang aking Pride Month content. So I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be anti- in honor of Pride Month to last na. I'll be answering some of your Pride Month related questions or gay questions or actually di ko alam kung ano yung mga questions sa radio. We will be having a Q&A, sit down Q&A while I wear outfits na dapat sana masasuot ko kung may Pride March. I'm not gonna show you any more packages kasi di naman to haul medyo but I'm gonna link all the items in the description kasi nabili ko lang ito lahat sa Shopee. So this is just another me wearing sexy underwear for you guys but this time it's color rainbow. So let's get into the video. Hey guys, so ito yung first fit. I'll just show you before tayo sumagot ng questions. Yeah! All of this is from Shopee. So parang mayroon lang tayong strap dito na parang kinky strap. Tapos yung white boxers na may rainbow lang din. So yan, that is the fit. Yeah! So I don't think papayag ang mga organizers of Pride March sa Sotik do. But this is the outfit that I would, would have worn. Siguro, parang siguro inside. Tapos siguro may pants lang. Ooh, wait, let's get some close-ups para di naman sayang. Para tuloy ako naka, naka bra set pero hindi. Diba? Okay, so so let's answer some questions. Di ko alam kung okay tong angle na to, pero wala na akong magagawa ito na yung bestest angle na pwede kong gawin. So anyway, let's begin! Tatlo kayo na nag-ask itong question na to. How did you come out? So first, actually mayroon akong video na ginawa about my coming out story. So if you guys wanna check out your entire, entire full-on, full-length drama and story, then I will link that in the description. Pero if you guys are in for the short version, then um... First, I came out on the first, 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 first. Kaya naman magiging second. <laughs> Basta super duper lasing lang ako ng time na yun. Kasi madami pinagdadaanan yung family namin. Super duper daming sobrang bigat ng pinagdadaanan ng family namin. And I thought na parang all this time perfect yung family ko. Tapos sa parang feeling ko sobrang unfair na like bawal ako umiyak. Tapos sila umiyak, sila lahat sa akin. Nag-explode lang ako. I was so drunk. I got home and then my parents hugged me. Tapos dun ko nasabi lahat, lahat, lahat ng about what happened to me and about who I am. Tapos the next day, nagpagapawa na wala akong sinabi kasi nga lasing ako. So I had an excuse na parang wala akong wishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishish
Para may league kasi ako na nakaganyan talaga yung underwear na mataas. As in yung bikini type. So kapag napupull siya dito, hindi naman ako, hindi naman ako nasasaktan. Hindi rin siya super duper comfortable minsan. Pero kasi gusto ko yung feeling na talagang salong-salo siya. Parang salong-salo siya. Kaysa sa yung naka-ano lang, naka-loose lang siya. Na parang, pero hindi ka rin nag-underwear. Yes! Yeah, supporting all the goods! Sabi niya, thoughts on internalized homophobia. So first, let's Google muna kung ano talaga yung internalized homophobia. Internalized homophobia occurs when a person is subject to society's negative perceptions, intolerance, and stigma toward the people with the same sex attraction. They then turn those ideas inward, believing that they are true, and experience self-hatred as a result of being socially stigmatized person. You believe na yung negative connotations about being part of the LGBT is true. So pwede yung example is, siguro kung kunyari ako, Becky ako, tapos hate ko din yung mga Becky. Dahil feeling mo salot sila. Dahil sinasabi ng buong mundo na salot sila. So, ikaw, kahit Becky ka mismo, iniisip mo na totoo na salot sila. So, ganun. So, my thoughts on that is you always have to validate your opinion and you always have to listen to other people. At saka minsan kasi may mga bagay na you have to agree to disagree. But remember, just be that person na open with ideas. But syempre, don't tolerate their hatred towards you and our community. Dapat in this time and age, we shouldn't really foster upon hatred. Kasi nga, hello, nagka-COVID na. Tara na, mag-solid mag na tayo guys. Let's be solid. Mabilis mawala ang buhay para mag-hate ng isa't isa. Now, let's change outfits, okay? Three, two, one. In. Hey. So this next one naman, again, feeling ko dito talaga ako papayagan sa Pride March kung may Pride March man kasi bala ko ito lang. Tapos siguro, pantaas, di ko alam, di ko alam, di ko alam, di ko alam. But yeah, you know what the story is. So ito lang yung next na outfit. Again, lahat to sa same brand ko lang binili para mabilis ipadala ni Shopee. Don't really know what to show you kasi ganito lang talaga siya. Okay. Let's secure the bag. Mas gusto ko kasi talagang ginaganyan siya guys Kasi mas thin The next question Next sabi Yummy! Salamat, salamat Thank you, thank you, thank you Although sometimes may mga mood ako na hindi ko talaga nakikitang compliment yung mga Yummy! Sarap mo! Ganyan Minsan nai-irit ako kasi Para kasi siyang cat calling in a sense Na instead na Ay po! Uy, ang ganda po ng suot niyo Diba kapag ganun yung sinabi sa'yo Parang mapapa Thank you, thank you Pero kapag yung dumaan ka Tapos sabihin sa'yo Ah, sarap! Parang Ano? Ano? Sumutok? Alam mo yun, parang kung babae yung ginanon mo, di ba parang ang bastos. Sana may isip nyo din, no? medyo bastos din siya pakinggan. Parang cut-colored din siya. Any advice for the younger generation for being part of the LGBTQIA community? Ngayon, lalabas. <laughs> Tami kong ideas, sabay-sabay sila pumasok. Di ko pa alam ano na ikaw. Sa generation na to, mas open kasi yung mga tao. But at the same time, there's so much pressure. Ngayon kasi lahat ng information is out there. Social media is there. Na lahat ng tao nagka-come out na lang sa social media. And sometimes it becomes a trend. Kasi kung yun yung in na lahat nagsishare baka ma-pressure ka. Don't be pressured to put labels on yourself and to tell people about yourself kasi hindi ka required. Lo, di ba beggy ka? Di ba beggy ka naman? Just let them be, you know? Parang curiosity kills. Kung ayaw mo pa, kung hindi ka pa ready sabihin, kung ikaw mismo hindi ka pa sure, or just don't be pressured to say something just because everyone is saying it. Your coming out story should be yours. Okay? 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 Tap, 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 tap. Secret to achieve that body. This body. This body. <laughs> Hindi ko po alam kasi pa iba-iba talaga honestly yung uh, yung body type. Pero in general, payatot po talaga ako. Pero mabilis akong lumaki dito. Lagi akong may, may extra fats yan. Hindi ko alam, may hindi talaga akong lumamon. Hindi <laughs> Iwala lang sa process. Tapos ako kasi, hindi sa pinamalit ko silikop. Pero hindi po talaga ganun kaganda yung katawan ko. Magaling lang ako one umangel. Kasi tignan nyo to ah. Ito, secret ko, secret ko lang to. Di ba lagi ako nakaganyan? Kasi ito yung maganda yung lighting. Pwede rin sa other side. Yan, maganda rin yung lighting yan, di ba? Pag ginanya ko, ganyan talaga itsura niya, di ba? Pero pag gumanyan ako, di ba? Wala siyang shape, wala siyang hotness. Tapos kapag sumayad ako, yan. Oh, laki niya, di ba? Kaya dapat lagi, tapos, tsh. Ganon. It's more about confidence. Ako kasi, mas confident ako kapag naka-underwear, kapag naka-hubad. Pag nakadamit ako, medyo mas parang feeling ko, oh, awkward. Lumalabas lahat na yung security ko. Pero kapag I put it all out there, oh, may nag-doorbell. Sige, pasok po. 
<laughs> Pero yun, kasi kapag I put it all out there, feeling ko nawawala yung insecurity ko, mas nagiging confident ako. First ever local actor crush. Ninang here, love you. Ah, si Ninang to! Si Ninang! Ninang ko na sa TikTok niya ako nakita. Tapos yun, pinalo niya na everywhere. Thank you, thank you so much, Ninang JV. First ever local crush ko, siguro top of mind. As in, yung patay na patay, si Paolo Avilino talaga. Pero yung sin bata ako, feeling ko crush na yun. Hindi ko lang inamin. Si Piolo Pascual or si Jericho Rosales. Oh, isa kasi Giro Manio. Yun, Giro Mano, Giro Manio. Yun, yung mga yun. Okay, let's uh, change outfit again in 3, 2, 1, and... Yeah, so for the last one, this is just the flag. Wait lang, pakita kasi inyo, baka umababat na it. So this is just the flag. So siguro kung talagang Pride Month, baka style ko siya something. Pero yan, this is the point. Parang nakaganyan lang tayo na parang... Yeah. So, ganyan lang. Ito lang yung gusto ko. Bahag hari. Bahag ari! Kasi yun. Ari! Kasi wala akong underwear. Alam mo, in-expect ko parang cute to tignan. Pero parang ang gulo-gulo lang niya. So, next is, how do you handle a homophobic person? Um, I don't. <laughs> sakit, 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 sakit. Okay, so the thing is, in reading this book, it's called... Wait lang, I'm a get book. Ayan, malapit na ako matapos actually if you check. So, this one is called The Subtle Art of Not Giving a Fuck. And man, am I gonna tell you, I am learning a lot about this book. I'm learning a lot about life. It's basically saying na konti na lang yung kaya natin ibigay ng fuck guys. Sa everyday ng buhay natin, ang dami natin masyadong binibigyan ng pake. Dapat mamili lang tayo ng mga talagang dapat na bigyan natin ng tunay na pake. Kasi nakakapagod yun kung lahat ng bagay ay papansinin natin. Lahat ng bagay we care about. Mas okay yung mas konti. Mas pili. It's not gonna help me as a person. So bakit ko siya bibigyan ng pake? Alam mo yun? Alam mo yun? Paano na yung mas nagbamatter ng mga bagay? Paano na yung family mo? Yung health mo? Yung work mo? Yung boyfriend mo? Yung friends mo, eh yun dapat yung mga bagay na talaga may pakailang ka. Pero dahil sobrang dami mo pang ibang binibigyan ng pake, nauubusan ka na ng pake para sa kanila. Does that make sense? Okay, so next is any tips paano tumagal ang isang relationship? My number one tip is communication. Number two is just keep the spark going. Like love, love, love lang talaga. As in every chance you get na pwede mo ipakita yung pagmamahal mo sa kanya, ipakita mo. Huwag kang magsasawa. Huwag kang magsasawang umintindi. Huwag kang magsasawa ng magmahal. And yun, kinikilig ako yun. Isip ko pala si Boy Fee. Pero yun, just, ano, just keep that energy. Choose, 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 love, choose, love, choose. What's your proudest moment being part of the LGBTQIA plus fam? Um, meron ka bang proudest moment? Went to the to my first pride. In a sense, I may be one person among the thousands and thousands of people na pumunta nun sa Marikina para umatend ng Pride Month. And sobrang stressful, guys. I made a vlog din dun na dati pa matagal na. Gusto nyo mapanood. May kumagat na naman sa akin. Lamo? Nakaka-proud kasi that's a contribution. The mere fact that I was there not because of trends but because I really wanted to support and to see my community and to see how loving we are and how colorful we are. Ka-proud yun. Kasi nga gets contribution na rin yun in small way I will contribute more soon hindi lang sa paghubad-hubad ko diba? okay so that's it and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this mother fuck video just make sure you love everyone love 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 lang and yeah puro yeah 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 this has been me your average guy is about to sky rocket Eh, dapat mong papalit pa akong damit para mag-outro pero tinatambad na ako guys. Ito na lang na yun. Okay. Bye guys. I love you. Hey! Happy Pride Month! Pride Month! Pride Month! If I can lay down beside you I would, I would When nothing really matters That's all I want to do